Hello friends. Welcome to the video tutorial of booking and reservation system for Magento 2. Now this module is super useful when you want to convert your Magento 2 store into an event driven site. That is a doctor's appointment site, booking, movie, seminar site. So from this module the admin can add two types of booking product mainly booking for a day and one booking for many days. So now let's come to the installation of this module. Once you have downloaded the module from the store, you will be getting in, in a zip format. What you have to do, you have to first unzip it and then you will be getting it in a folder. Just click on the folder, you will be getting the SRC folder. Just click on the SRC folder, you will be getting the app folder. Just upload the app folder into your Magento 2 your directory and then you are done with the installation part. Now let's come to the admin panel and see how the admin can add two types of product that is many booking in a day and one booking for many days. So just let's move to the admin panel. Now this is my admin panel. So on the left hand side you will be seeing the product menu. So just click on this product menu. You will be seeing the catalog sub menu. So just click on the catalog sub menu. Now you will be seeing the catalog page. So here you can see the list of products added by the admin and from here you can add a new product. So just click on this drop down then you can see the booking product so this booking product will come after you have installed our module so just click on this booking product so that you can add booking products from your vision to do site now this is the add new page so you will just add the name of the product it is like adding any product you can add the ticket per price, quantity of the tickets in stock. You can select the categories and then you can see the booking information. Now it is disabled from this drop down. You can select many booking in a day, one booking for many days. So I will select many booking in a day. From here, I will select the date of when the booking will start and the end date of booking this will be the time slots of the booking and this will be the break between the two bookings so now this is the day now this is the hour this is the minute so this will be the start time you can set the hours and minute for the start time and this will be the end time hours and minute and this is the status open and close if it is open then it will be displayed to the customer and if it is closed then the booking for this particular day will not be displayed to the customer so they cannot book the slots for this particular day if it, the status is closed so i will just fill the details and then we will see how it is reflected on the front end so i will show you one example for example on sunday the booking will start at And you can enter the hour and minutes and you can set the status open and if you if you want you can set the status as close as well so I will just fill the other details and then we will see on the front end now you can see that I have saved this product so again I will add a new product this was mainly booking for a day and the other one will be one booking for many days so this can be used for doctor appointment or movies or any other related thing so I will again go to this drop down I will select booking product now you can see the page so again I will write the detail And now you can see the booking information so i will select one booking for many days start day end day and i can add the booking so this this is the minute and this is the seconds so like this i can add the bookings now this is my front end so you can see just now I have added 
this doctor appointment and seminar. So let's see how this product work. So now you can see the price per ticket and the book now option. So I will just click here so you can see the slots for various days. So when you will click here, you can see no slots is available on this day. We have purposely put one day as no slot because how it will display when there is no slots available. So I will click here on Saturday. On Saturday you can see from 5 to 5 14 5 16 to 5 20 500 slots are available for each day each time slot sorry so i will just book and you can see that this seminar has been added so now we will just proceed to the checkout Now you can see this page. This is my billing address, and you can see the. So this was my booking, and now I will click here to place the order. And so now again in the admin panel, you can go to the booking system, and you can see all the bookings done. So this is the grid. So this was the order ID, and this was the seminar. So I will just click here on this action button and then you can see the information and here you can see the details booking from and booking till and the same you can see in the invoice as well you can see that the status is paid you can see the details and on the product page you can see the slots has been reduced from 500 to 300 as 200 slots has been sold. So this was the part. Now let's come to the other booking part that is one booking for many days. Now this is the product one booking for many days. So we will click here. So you can see on Friday from 6 to 9, 100 slots are available on saturday the booking timing and on sunday so i will again book the time i can book the slot like i will buy 90 and then i will click here and now you can see this 90 slots has been added and then i will proceed to my checkout page now here, here you can see the details and the booking details and you can place the order.